Well, I'm still here, thank God. If I die, people will know from my diary about me and the dreams I had. So far, I have been lucky and all of my family are safe and well. Today was the worst day of the bombing. I close my eyes and think for a moment that if I open my eyes, I will find myself dead. Then, I open my eyes and I'm still alive. More bombs, More bombs today. today. They, they sound, sound slow. slow. But none of us leaves the house so that we do not know where they are falling. The walls shake and the floor moves. It's like an earthquake. The roof may collapse in any moment. I do not feel like eating today. My mother makes my favorite food for lunch. She thinks I will eat. Well, I cannot. She says, you are just a teenager. You need food more than us. My mother and I have decided to move in with my aunt on the other side of the town. Perhaps it's safer there. My father and my brother are staying at our house. I do not think they are scared like us. I feel, I feel that, that writing, writing my diary, diary is a waste, waste of time, time because, because I might die tomorrow. So, so what's, what's the, the use of carrying on? As usual, just a couple of hours sleep. We had breakfast in the kitchen. After that, we sat in the garden because the weather was so nice. I saw a small nest in a tree. There were two small birds in it. How can such a tiny nest survive? If they can, then I can as well. <laughs>